afternoon. You join me once again in my car, um, full of fishing gear, but what else should a car be used for, really? There's the question. Anyway, um, I am down the lake. My dad's been fishing on here today for the pike, which is very, very strange for him, but unfortunately he's had no luck. There's a few other people down here as well after the pike, again with no luck. However, I know the lake and I know this is a good time for them to feed. So I've got an hour to spare. The weather is meant to get bad. You can probably hear a little bit of drizzle now. It's been very on and off, but it is meant to get a bit heavier later on. Fingers crossed we'll get the hour. Fingers crossed we might even have a fish or two to show you as well. Um, who knows? just in this next swim and very quickly landed beautiful little jack no more than a couple of pounds at absolute most stunning little fish still quite warm out here today although it's overcast so I'm not going to take too long I'm going to get him back in the water and watch him swim off What a take was that. Close up, right on my feet, full impact. The water's very warm today, so I think you've got something to say. 
Um, I was just having a chat with another pike fisherman who spent the day on here today and he's caught nothing. Um, so it just goes to show changing up the tactics, roaming about a little, looking for those signs on the top of the water can really produce you some great results. Got him in the net, been resting for a little bit too long, had to try and help someone get past an angry swan. Not something you have to do every day, but he's safe and sound now. So we'll get him out of the net, we'll have a little look at him. A um, little tiny bit bigger than uh, the last that we had a few minutes ago on the other swim. Uh, completely different colours, less prominent markings, but still really beautiful dark pike. And here he is. So I would give this one probably a grand total of about four pounds possibly five. He's gonna kick out. He's full of beans, full of energy. I have one there we go, there we go. Oh. Trying to keep the kisser away a little bit because I've been slapped by him once already today. Look at that back fin go. Oh, there we go. Beautiful little fish. So four, maybe five pounds. Now this side he's got a bit of a spawning rash on him just there. Um, nothing down the other side, just there, gorgeous little pike, beautiful dark markings, we're going to get him back in, we're going to watch him swim off, almost looks like his tail's had a bite taken out of it as well, who knows, we'll see, let's get him back in, let's watch him swim, beautiful pike. As you may be able to hear or see on the water, the rain is coming. Um, rain was forecast today. It's been somewhat dry over the last week or so, so it's well due for all the plants in the garden. Uh, I'm not gonna complain about it. Uh, everything does need a little shower right now, but that does mean I'm done for today. So I'm gonna pack up, get the stuff in the car. Still had about 45 to 50 minutes today two fish in that time, two lovely little jacks. Um, brilliant little session really. Keep tuned, keep posted and river season opens soon so hopefully you'll see me have a few on the rivers as well.